We're recording. So come up here. Oh, I'm allowed to step in the frame now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You ready? I suppose. Good morning, everybody. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> dickhead. Sorry, sorry. No mistake. Good morning. <laughs> Distracted. <laughs> Good morning everybody and welcome to the 2017 Victorian trout season. Today is trout opening. I'm here with my mate Wayne Gardner from Bachman Batteries in Albury who has proudly sponsored this trip with this beanie from Adelco. Ad AC Delco. What is it? AC Delco. AC moron. Delco. Is that the battery that you put in my car? Yes. Thank you very much. If you need a battery for your car go and see a moron at AC Delco. <laughs> Bachman's. Bachman, at Bachman's. Bachman's in Aubrey. Seriously, folks, a trout opening. We are off to a great start. We've already caught the team. Between us, we've landed four trout already. <laughs> we are having a great time. It's only about 8 o'clock in the morning. We're on fire. The fishing's red hot, and we're going to continue. One thing we've already discovered this morning, I started with a bladed spinner. Straub started with a bullet lure, a little minnow. And Straub's caught more than I did with the minnow. <laughs> I'm not going to give you exact Skill. numbers. Right. Uh, the, exactly, Robert. There's right. a fair bit of luck involved. But anyway, I decided to change over to a little minnow as well. I mean, in the first couple of, min couple of minutes, I caught a trout. So minnows are go. And that's a big key when you're trout fishing. If something's not working, change it up and try something different. I've said that or before. Or like anything in life, leader, follower. You know how it is, guys. Remember that? Leader, leader, follower. So when he's whinging that I'm up in front, I'm going to say it's because I'm a leader. All right, folks, we're going to go and catch some more fish. I hope you enjoy this video, and I hope you had a great trout opening. <laughs> you idiot. Yet yeah, they're going mad. <laughs> Finally. A oh, great cast. That deserves a fish. That doesn't. That's in the tree. Oh, he's got one! Scrobs is onto a good fish! Ha ha! Scrobs is uh, 1 0. Look at that! What a lovely trout! You're a legend! Hey, I'm, I'm gonna get a camera and take a photo of the great man himself with his first trout of the season. Straubs has hit the front. Hold him up a bit, mate. He's, uh, no one wants to see your groin in the photo. Look at my groin. Let me know I'm looking for you. Yeah. You hold him. I really don't want this hook in me finger. These bullets have only got a rear hook, have they? Well, unless he ate the front one. <laughs> Robert. That's uh, wise that you've picked that up. Now, no need for smart comments, just because you've hit the front with your first and only fish for the day. Well done, Mr. Gardner. See, I told you you were going to get into a fish. I told you to have faith in me. When I, you criticise me all the time and you bag out my ability to choose fishing spots. Less chat, more work. Let's go. Unbelievable. here or are you my cameraman for the day? <laughs> funny, funny. You think you're so good because you've hit the front. That's all about to change. Any time now, any, with any cast, I can level the scores. <laughs> like you said, I suggest you just enjoy being in the front while it lasts. Enjoy your moment in the sun. Enjoy your moment in the trees and on the other bank too. <laughs> You can see where the floods have come through here last week and washed all the worms into the system. Oh, look. I caught the tree. I'm panicking now. Yeah. You've, you've, <laughs> you've put me under pressure. Yeah. You one again. Oh, you've got to be joking. Probably not. I'm not, taking, I'm not even going to take a photo. You haven't got a spare bullet lure I can borrow, have you? <laughs> thought. I can sell you one for forty dollars, though. So this is how you break your fishing rod, girls and boys. Is oh. yes, please no profanities, thank you, Mr. Gardner. That's <laughs> how you land them. Oh, look at this! What a lovely little trout caught on the bullet lure. I'm going to leave you to unhook that while I go fishing. I'll just turn the video camera off because. 
I had uh, I had already made two or three casts in there and done no good. Then Straubs has just moved in behind me with a bullet lure. With a bullet, with a bullet lure, and I thought I'll take it. Number one with a bullet. Number one with a bullet. <laughs> Words authorised and spoken by Wayne Gardner on behalf of the Wayne Gardner Foundation. <laughs> what a lovely fish. Just hold him up a bit higher. This lens doesn't zoom. The only zoom I've got is if I walk backwards and forwards. So if you could just be so kind as to uh, just cooperate, that'd be great. Sorry about the, uh, I know you don't like lying in your shots. I don't care. Well, you would. I just don't like when you lie and when you tell people that you yeah, outfish me. You could have smiled a bit more. Hang on. Well, it, you know, catching three in a row. Smile. Pretty much over it. I think I'll go back to the car. Smile. <laughs> Rightio folks, Straubs is out fishing me, three to love, three to none. This is unacceptable behaviour. But on a serious note, what that tells me is that Straubs has cracked the code. Minnows are the go, so I am switching to a minnow. Some days minnows work better than bladed spinners, some days bladed spinners work better than soft plastics. All day Straubs works better than Robbie, apparently. I don't know. Work, you don't know how work is. As far as Straubs is aware, manual labour is a, uh, a, Greek is, a, is a Greek immigrant that owns a fish and chip shop in Albury. Rightio. Eh? I've got a little wild bait minnow. Straubs has got a little bullet minnow. I've gone this colour because it's nice and shiny. It's a little bit shinier. And the water's not quite as clear as I'd like it to be. Minnow me up. I've got to make a late charge. I've got to do a Tony Lockett and kick about eight goals in the last quarter, otherwise I'm going to get a flogging. I should be a singer. Could be, but you're not. Glad it been a fisherman, I'd just come straight on that. Oh, look! Oh, you yeah. did see that? Didn't see it, mate. Nah, that's two now. Two to three. I didn't see it. I didn't hit a fucking rock. I didn't hit a, a, a jolly rock, Wayne. He was, an, he was the biggest one today. He was easily bigger than any of yours. I don't get as bigger as mine's your mouth. <laughs> it was uh, no, it's very sad. Right. So the difference with my good cast and your good cast is I can put the very next cast exactly just as good. I can, you watch, I'll talk now, I'll just keep talking, I won't stop talking, I'm going to talk now so that I can talk while I'm casting and you can see how like, I'm going to land this lure right next to that tussock while I'm talking while I'm casting at the same time and here I go, here goes the cast, look at that perfect cast right next to the tussock right while I was talking. Now you just said that I can't talk while I'm casting. Yeah, but that was easy. I can talk underwater with a mouthful of marbles. Got him. Yeah. <laughs> He's lean. He's a very thin fish. I might get you to get a photo of me if that's okay. I'll put it in auto for you so it's uh, not too confusing. Quick, stop bagging me out and just hold the camera. It's the same as the other one, but you don't have to look through the viewfinder, you look through the back. And push the button halfway down. Push look at that one. That looks right. I wet my hand. Yep. Alright, come on, fishy. Not a big fish, but a fish. I'm to learn that. I'll him. Righty, -o, here we go. Not a monster trout, but uh, a nice little brown trout, all the same. See you later, buddy. <laughs> right, three all. Hey! <laughs> three, two. <laughs> I'm counting the one that got off. I reckon the one that I lost plus the one that I just followed there equals one if you add them together. <laughs> I can hear a rooster.
Do roosters lay eggs or is it just chooks? Oh, what are they? Roosters do too, don't they? No, they wouldn't, would they? Well, what are they out there? Arts, what are they? Where does the egg come from? <laughs> That's going to be one of the stupidest questions I've ever asked. The more I think of it, the more I reckon I could have worked that one out without actually having to ask. <laughs> well, I was just thinking, we had four chooks and one of them turned into a rooster and we've got lots of eggs, but they must have come from the hens, not the rooster. <laughs> I can't believe I just asked that. Strobes is on. Right, yeah, the score's at 4 2. Another lovely little brown trout there, Mr. Gardner. Yeah. Would you like some help with that, or are you right? Give it a kiss and put it back. <laughs> well done. Now the camera's been off for a while on the charger and while that happened there's been a bit of a turnaround. Scores are now five each. Of course too. Wayne's got the sads because he never saw one of them and so he's disputing never saw it. One, never heard one and you've got no footage now come on. Wayne's disputing my claim. If he was any sort of a friend there be, wouldn't be trust issues in our relationship. Plenty. So uh, it's five apiece. Real friendships don't rely on uh, evidence, they rely on trust. Right, I'll remember that this gun. So next time I leave Wayne, when I come back he's going to say, I caught seven while you weren't watching. That's correct. Because I don't trust him. That's how it rolls. <laughs> Got him, yes, yes, number six. Yes, I've hit the front. I have hit the front. After a slow start, I've hit the front. <laughs> Straubs is up there in front of me trying to get the first cast in, but it's not going to happen. I'll get the camera out and get a happy snap. I have hit the front. Right, we'll, we'll go home now. Ready to finish? You finished? Had enough? Time to leave yet? Time to go home. What? Not sure what you're saying. Five. Oh. No, it's not five all at all, Wayne. You can't take that one yes, I can. It's not my fault you weren't watching. Yeah, no. Nah. There you go, buddy. Thanks. There you go, Mr. Six. Thanks, number six, for helping me hit the front. Right, six to five. We can go home now. Rightio, we've just pulled up stumps. The score is, what was the score again? Six to five in my favour. Five all. I've caught six, Wayne's caught five. I am the trout opening champion. At one stage it was two to five. Then I made a late comeback and it's now six to five. And we're going home now because we're going to quit while I'm ahead. <laughs> we, what, this is how the day unfolded. I started off with a bladed spinner. Straub started off with a minnow. He caught three fish, bang, bang, bang. And I naturally put on a minnow to do the same thing as he was doing. Then I caught a fish, 
Things slowed down a fair bit after that. We lost a couple, hooked a couple, missed a couple. Still and, counted them as yours. <laughs> and then spent uh, copious amounts of time fishing holes without fishing them. But now it's just been a nice steady start to the season for us. We've caught 11 between us and lost a few others. It's been all right. And they've all been caught on minnows. At one stage I tried a soft plastic and I started with a bladed spinner, as I said. And it was all about soft plastics on the day. About uh, hard body minnows on the day. Have you got anything you'd like to add, Mr Gardner? Uh, yeah, yeah, I would. Like this, is, we, Robbie and myself catch up once a year probably for this. And it's not just about the fishing, it's about mates getting around each other. And I think that's more of an important um, thing in society. Mates sticking together and choose the fat a bit. Get out and have a, have a chat to each other. Talk about your problems and your issues. Cheers. There you go, folks. Comments from the super cage. Very well said. I couldn't have said it better myself. And we even learn a thing or two on these trips. For example, today I learned that roosters don't lay eggs. But seriously, surely... <laughs> We've all asked the question without putting much thought into it. How do I stop them thought about it? I reckon I would have worked that one out for myself. <laughs> Maybe. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribed because trout season has just opened and I'm just going to bombard YouTube with fishing videos. I'm excited. You should be excited too. And I hope you've had a great opening to the trout season.